troopers say this is a perfect example of doctor shopping. Friday morning around 11, a man was pulled over in Bryan County. I made contact with the subject. He had uh, slurred speech. He was uh, had uh, very uh, lethargic movements. An infield sobriety test led to an arrest for the driver being DUI. A search of his car led troopers to a plastic bag full of prescription bottles. But it seems like the abuse of medications and those types of things are, are rising. Some bottles full, some empty. One prescription filled Thursday with 90 capsules gone. Kicker is some of the prescriptions in the truck were the same, just from different pharmacies, one in Durant and one in Denison. Doctor shopping is a phenomenon where an individual may go from different doctor's offices in hopes of obtaining uh, multiple prescriptions. Illegal under both state and federal law, whether for one's own use or selling or distribution. States including Texas and Oklahoma have a prescription monitoring program to crack down on the abuse. The search can be crossed with neighboring states, even the entire country. But with these tools in place, how do people slip through the cracks? In the emergency room setting, we always look at potential drugs of abuse. That may not be the case in a general practice. And so if a provider is unaware that an individual is crossing state boundaries and seeing uh, an additional uh, primary care provider, uh, they may be uh, at a higher likelihood of falling through the cracks. Troopers say there's a need for more communication and better monitoring to stop the epidemic. In Bryan County, Bailey Bates, K10 News.